What is up YouTube, IDM here, and welcome back to another video. So we're gonna be taking a look at the Unveil app by the lead developer of the Uncover Jailbreak, Pwn to Own. So uh, this is an application that he just released that happened to be at the same time as a update for the Uncover Jailbreak. Now, unfortunately, this is causing a lot of controversy. So if we hop onto the jailbroken iPhone here and we go to, uh, let me find the Uncover website. If we go to uncover.dev. So as you can see, what's new in version 6.2.0, major stability and reli reliability improvements to iOS 14. I did do a previous video on this, um, stating that I think it's important that you guys do update to this version simply because that's what you know they're, they're saying is new. Of course, anything that says major stability and reliability improvements, uh, I would highly recommend to update. But a lot of people are thinking the reason why this update came out was because of Unveil. So that's kind of silly in my opinion. I don't think that Pwn to Own should have released an application at the same time as an uncovered jailbreak update. Um, I think that's a very bad idea. Uh, just because a lot of people are thinking now that the jailbreak update really isn't anything and it's just a, you know, kind of like a placeholder for the application launch. So I'm going to get a little bit into depth with this video and talk about Unveil. Now, Unveil, um, it's a little pricey. I, I think it's $5. So $5 and it's basically a system information application. So you can view all of your system information from the application, your CPU usage, your memory usage, your disk space, you have wired uh, usage, cellular, personal hotspot, your device name and device information, marketing name, device model, so on and so forth. It's just a bunch of information. Now, there's already really good applications, I think, in the App Store. One that I use is CPUX. I've had this for, I think, a couple years now, and this is what I use for all of my system information. You basically get everything in this application that you do in that app. But I don't wanna knock the work because I do think the UI does look pretty nice, but it's just kind of strange and here's why. So this is it on a non-jailbroken iPhone. Now, of course, the creator of this application is the lead developer of a jailbreak. So you would think that people that are jailbroken would be appealed to it. Now, on a jailbroken iPhone, there are better options than Unveil. Now, of course, you have your security stuff here, um, but the application is still sandboxed. It's not like a tweak. It's still sandboxed. So it can only access certain information. It's not like tweaks, which is, to me, like I said, just very strange that the lead developer of Uncover released an app that's, if anything, probably best off on an unjailbroken iPhone, in my opinion. And in my opinion, you can get a better combo than Unveil on a jailbroken iPhone. So if you're jailbroken, um, iSecure OS is probably one of the best applications if you're looking for vulnerabilities on your iPhone. Super simple application. You just scan your iPhone. It's not sandboxed, so it accesses all your jailbreak files and it scans them. And then you can view these vulnerabilities. And as you can see, it's presented to you in a simple form. Also, a free tweak, a free tweak uh, called System Info basically brings all of that system information that you guys saw in CPUX and Unveil, it brings it and it puts it into the general section and the about section of your iPhone settings. So it basically puts all of that info in there. I don't wanna go in there because it shows IP addresses. It shows just a, basically everything that you need to know about your iPhone. It will show it in the about section when you have system info installed. So I'll go ahead and pull up uh, system info right here. So this is the tweak right here. I will leave it down in the description if you guys want to check it out. Like I said, this is free and it brings you basically all of that information. And not only that, you can set your nonce, you can save blobs, you can do all of the jailbreak related stuff. So that's why I'm confused because on a jailbroken iPhone, there are better alternatives 
then the unveil application and the unveil application was created by a jailbreak developer. So very, very confusing. Uh, like I said, I think the UI looks nice, but um, I can't really recommend it just because you can get that information basically for free and you can get a better, you know, vulnerability scanner by GeoSnow with iSecure OS. So like I said, I think that uh, Unveil is a little weird um, and that's my opinion on it. So hopefully you guys found this video useful. If you did, definitely throw me a thumbs up. That helps me out a lot here at the channel. And if you guys want to see more videos like this in the future, don't forget to click that subscribe button. This has been Jeremy and I will catch you guys in the next one. Later.